Battlefield 3 is the best Battlefield. To the people that didn't get to play Battlefield 3 during its prime, you really missed out because this was easily one of, if not the greatest Battlefield experience of all time. The maps, the weapons, the destruction made this one of the most iconic games in the franchise, not to mention its main menu music. Oh god, I think I might need a towel. Battlefield 3 released in 2011 and was DICE's big return to a more realistic style of game design. If you don't recall, the last few iterations were, um, not as realistic as this. Where did the hacker go? There's gold in them hills! Shit, that's a neutral zone. The game comes with three modes, a campaign, co-op, and a multiplayer. The campaign is the textbook definition of mid. The missions themselves are pretty fun, sometimes require a towel due to all the action and some of the heartbreak, even at times with said action leaving your jaw dropping. The actual story follows Blackburn in the present day of 2014, and it's honestly just an absolute snooze. I'll kind of just break it down this way. You start off as an ordinary soldier, who after a big earthquake sees the big bad, where later on you and your team discover a couple nukes that are going to be deployed in Paris and New York, and after a bunch of generic soldier shit happens, results in you fighting the big bad Solomon in Times Square. Seriously, is no one gonna help this guy? Also, this guy dies, spoilers, this guy dies, spoilers, also this guy dies, spoilers, and this guy dies, spoilers, but this one was more heartbreaking because he had a dinosaur. Battlefield 3 also has a co-op mode, it's literally just spec ops from Call of Duty, but in Battlefield. You'll play it once and you'll never play it again, and since no one I know actually plays this game anymore, or for some reason won't return my calls, I couldn't get any actual footage of my own since it doesn't have any matchmaking. Actually, quick update, I lied, there is matchmaking, but no one really plays it, meaning there's no matchmaking. Speaking of matchmaking, let's be honest, the reason you probably bought Battlefield 3 was because of its multiplayer. I mean, any promotional material leading up to the release was amazing and really just set the tone for this to be a more serious, grounded Battlefield experience. The multiplayer seems to have taken some of the best aspects of the franchise, like its customization, its guns, its map design, and destruction, and crafted it into one of the best multiplayer experiences the entire franchise has ever seen. And while I say Battlefield 3 was realistic, people were just doing some of those unrealistic things. For example, the guy that jumped out of a plane to only shoot down another plane with an RPG to then get back in his plane was an absolutely amazing thing to witness in the early days of YouTube. So amazing that they literally put it into the Battlefield 2042 trailer. Enough positivity, now for the negativity. The game in 2023 is borderline unplayable. The servers on console seem to be barely populated with one to two servers active at a time. The active servers seem to only provide the option of conquest or rush, with maps like Metro, Firestorm, Canals, or Karg Island being the only ones playable. It also seems as though the server browser is bugged and sometimes shows no open servers, yet if you try quick match, you get into a lobby within a minute depending on the game mode. Now here's the other bad news. It was announced that some Battlefield game servers would be shut down by the end of the year, namely Battlefield Bad Company 1 and 2. And while Battlefield 3 wasn't on any list that I could find, it wouldn't surprise me to see the server shut down sometime next year. Because if you haven't heard, Battlefield 2042 has Battlefield 3 in its port. Portal, which sounds great until you realize it's basically the we have Battlefield 3 at home version of Battlefield 3 and I'd imagine they'd want more people jumping over to Battlefield 2042 and spending money and using the portal that they probably spent a good amount of time and money on rather than a game that's probably just a little bit outdated. Regardless, Battlefield 3 to me is the best Battlefield title. Yeah, future iterations improved on the whole evolution thing, but I always appreciated the groundedness of Battlefield 3. And while yes, you can still find a server, it's becoming more and more clear that it's becoming more difficult by the day to find a good game of multiplayer, which again, makes me believe we're coming up on the final days of Battlefield 3 servers. Which again, is sad because I genuinely believe this is a game that should have been remastered instead of being put into the portal so that way everyone could experience it. But I want to know what you think. Do you think Battlefield 3 is the best Battlefield game? Also, do you think they should have possibly remastered it at some point instead of Battlefield 2042? Let me know what you think in the comments section below. And uh, well, bye.